Hey guys, welcome back to Kay's Place. So as promised, I do have a small Dollar Tree haul for Friday night. Um, my name's Dana. So for all of you who are currently subscribed, I hope you all are having a wonderful Friday night. If you're not currently subscribed, I hope you'll stick around for a while and consider subscribing to our small but growing family. We do a lot of exciting things on my channel. We're doing some I have some DIYs coming up and I am getting ready to hopefully get some collabs going with some fellow YouTubers who are amazing crafters who put me to shame in the DIY department, but who you all will love to watch. Um, I have a box swap coming up soon with another DIYer and another YouTuber who is a lovely lady. So stick around. I think you'll be pleasantly surprised. So let me stop talking and I will show you what I picked up tonight at two Dollar Trees that I stopped off at on my way home. So Christmas, really? Christmas? What's worse is I bought Christmas stuff. So I picked up two of these berry bouquets. I just thought these were so cute. And they only had very few of them, but they were just like these little dark berries with like, I don't know, grass around them. But I thought they were so cute and they kind of are glittery. So I picked up two of those. And then I picked up one of these other berry bouquets with the dark berries on these. And then I picked up two, and these are the only two that they had. They had a bunch of gold ones and a bunch of other colors, like with the red glitter and green glitter, but these were the only two silver that they had. I picked up two of the holly bouquets with the silver pine cones. So I really like those. So I picked those two up. And then... Uh, they had a bunch of the breast cancer stuff, and my Dollar Tree, the, this Dollar Tree I stopped at, was packed full of people. I don't know whether it was because they just got off work or what was going on. I would have taken pictures. Hopefully, I'll get out this weekend and take some for you guys. They had a bunch of breast cancer awareness things, and I did pick up a little um, breast cancer awareness keychain. My husband's aunt died of breast cancer, and so we always try to pick up a little something around October, something new, and I picked up a breast cancer awareness keychain, so picked that up, and I picked up this cute little, it's called a manicure set, this little purse manicure set. I constantly lose my tweezers, my fingernail file, my nail clippers. And this has the cuticle scissors, um, the little cuticle pushers. It's got a metal nail file, which I never use unless I'm digging something out from underneath my fingernails. Um, fingernail clippers, and a pair of tweezers in it. So I thought, you know, this would be perfect for me to throw in like my overnight bag or in my makeup bag in my purse, something like that. So I picked one of these little bad boys up, and this was in the, they had a pink pattern as well, but I really like the blue and gray one. It kind of matches um, one of the little uh, makeup bags that I've picked up at the Dollar Tree before. So went ahead and picked that up. And then I finally found the GE Reveal Clean Beautiful Light, the 75 watt, the four count of the bulbs. Normally, I can only find the one single bulb for a dollar. I found the four pack. So, I was really happy to find those. It's the only one they had, though. So, but I did pick up the one box they had. And I found these beautiful, like, rose gold kind of coppery leaf wall stickers. There will be a DIY coming up with these for fall. I promise you. These stickers are going on something for my table for fall. Very soon. I 
saw Southern Christy haul those and I was determined I was finding those bad boys because I have something those are going on my table. And I was actually on the hunt for something. Let me get these out of my bag here. A very dear friend of mine, I was watching her channel the other day and I had sent her something and in her pocket letter I mailed her, I had included some of these cute little owls. And she said she'd been looking for them everywhere. So I went on the hunt for these little felt owl stickers. So I picked my friend up some of these felt owls. And while I was out, I found the pumpkins. And there's two different kinds of pumpkins in here. And there's bats and black cats. So I picked her up a bag of those. And then I picked her up this bag with pumpkins and bats and ghosts in it. And these are by Crafter Square. And this bag with the pumpkins and black cats, or the pumpkins and bats and ghosts, there's 16 count in this one. And the one that has the smaller pumpkins and the cats and the other bats, there's a 20 count in this one. And then the owls, I guess because they're bigger and they have the little gems in the eyes, there's only eight count of the owls. They're all by Crafter Square. So that was actually all in the two Dollar Trees I went to. That was all I picked up. So they really didn't have a whole lot out that was new. I'm on the hunt for some candy jars to do a DIY. So when I find that, we'll have another little DIY for you guys for fall. So stay tuned because I've got some really cool things coming up for you all. So I like to set my table and make my table look pretty for fall or for any holiday really because we don't use our dining room a whole lot. I don't know if you all have one of those dining rooms that you don't use very much. We do. My dining room table is either a craft table. My Cricut is sitting here right now. Or it's either a place we play cards, we play games, we craft here, or it is set up for show. We don't eat here very often. We eat in our family room, we eat in the basement, watching TV together. We eat together, we just hardly ever do it at our table, unless we have company. So usually it's all fixed up with pretty napkins and tablecloths and it looks all pretty. So, this DIY is for a pretty table. So, stay tuned. I think you're going to like it. So, that was all I found at the Dollar Tree. Next time, I promise there'll be pictures. So, I hope you all have a wonderful Friday night. Please check out the two videos that I filmed tonight. This one and the winners of the planner video. That video came up right before this one. So, I hope you all have a wonderful weekend. And I will see you all next week. Well, actually, I will see you all on Sunday because I will have a plan with me up on Sunday night. So I hope you all have a wonderful Saturday and Sunday. And I will see you all Sunday night with my plan with me. So you all have a wonderful rest of your weekend. And I will see you all on Sunday. Thank you for watching. Thank you so much for all of your support and kindness and kind words. And... Thank you so much. I mean, I just couldn't. I wouldn't have the ability to be here without you. You make this possible for me. So thank you. Because without you, I wouldn't be able to do this. And I enjoy doing this. So thank you. So, like I said before, I hope you can give this video a thumbs up. If you're currently subscribed, thank you so much for your support. If you're not currently subscribed, please consider sticking around. I think you'll enjoy it. Thanks again for all of your support and your kind words, and I hope you all have a wonderful weekend. Bye.